So the Perkins strategy is to be a full range engine supplier. So here in Europe, that means EU stage five, but across different global emissions regulations, we intend to offer a full range of products. And that means from six kilowatts to over 600 kilowatts. Obviously this requires a high level of investment uh, and that's been continuing for several years. Uh, and we expect it to continue uh, for several years into the future. Some examples of uh, range gaps that we've been working on are the Perkins Synchro 2.8 and 3.6, uh, which we launched at Bauma last year. Um, and then we've also been extending the power range from the previous upper limit of 250 kilowatts to the new 600 kilowatts through the addition of four new products at the top end. So apart from filling gaps and extending the power range, we're also very focused on offering some choices around key power nodes. Um, an example of a power node in our industry is 19 kilowatts, which corresponds with uh, an emissions regulations breakpoint. So just below 19 kilowatts, we're actually going to offer four different engine uh, solutions at uh, EU stage five. And these engine solutions will correspond with the different power and torque and packaging requirements of some of the key uh, applications in our market. Being a full range supplier helps our customers in a number of ways. The relationships that OEMs have with engine suppliers are becoming much more complicated. It's not a buy sell, it's more of a partnership these days. Uh, so it's quite a complicated relationship and to have those relationships with multiple engine suppliers is a business inefficiency. So by being able to offer a full range of engines, each engine competitive in its own right, we can actually provide some efficiencies to the OEM. For Perkins, it's not just about introducing new products, it's about improving and in increasing the capabilities of existing products. Uh, so for several products in the range, we are uh, dramatically increasing power and torque, uh, and for others, we're actually improving fuel consumption.